good evening and welcome to MMO Monday. Tonight I will be playing Lost Ark, continuing to run around on my bard and hopefully kick some ass along the way, you know, because I like doing that, and have fun. There's not really a lot to catch up from last time, uh, despite my not playing Lost Ark last week. At the moment, I am on a continent in the game called Annika, and I am fighting in a tournament, which I have been winning so far. So, let's get right into the game. There's my girl. Okay, now that we've had a good gaze into Bitter Vine's eyes, Let's talk to Yule and fight Gunga. Oh, you look troubled. Uh, did Gildal say something to upset you? <gasps> you... you didn't fight him, did you? No, I was thinking about my next match. I see, hmm. You'll be fighting Gunga now. He's really, really strong, but I'll be rooting for you, Bittervine. So, try your best to win. All right, start the match. Let's go. Let your match with Gumga begin. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Show us what you're capable of. I intend to. The challenger enters the arena for their next match. Fancy. It's none other than Gunga, the legendary second sword and conqueror of Annika. The new challenger is impressive. His powerful aura is on a different level. He trains hard for this event. I am Gunga. I am the champion of Chongbun and a master of martial arts. Come. Okay. Now he is capable of ranged attacks, so I do have to keep an eye on him. His opponent, the challenger, doesn't seem to be backing down. No one can predict who will win. Can you feel the tension in the air? You don't want to miss a minute of yeah, let's, let's pull up the flash orb. Put out my ego harp. Homing missiles! Whoops! Oh, he actually hit me there. But he's almost done. And now he's giant size Gumga! With a whole new HP bar. I did. Oops! That was nearly bad. Alright, let's bring out the Ego Harp again. Ow! Let's run with the homing missiles what again. A great attack! Eat my laser! Oh, I he ate my laser, but I did not eat his. I'll, I'll admit, his looked a little, um, cholesterol-laden. Let's see if I just... Oh, got the shield on just in time there. Oh, he is, he is nibbling on my HP there. Oops. Oh, that was more than a nibble. Alright, I'm, I'm gonna have an HP potion just to be certain. 
Oh yeah, that's lo that that looks like an excellent idea. Exploding orbs, yes. He's still got a foot in it. It's all good. Got him. I mean, besides the uh, giant size AoEs, a bigger target is just more to hit, honestly. Well, that sound just cut off abruptly. Alright, talk to Gunga. I gave it everything I had, but in the end, I lost to the stronger fighter. All right. Our match is over. What other business do you have with me? You met a demon, didn't you? Ah, <laughs> demons? Did you say demons? Yes, I did meet a demon, in fact. It was a few months ago, during my training. A demon approached me and offered me so-called endless power. Needless to say, I bested that demon right there and then. Cracked its head open like a watermelon. Even so, I sensed it was just an agent of a much more powerful demon. I'd never want to become strong that way. I'd die first. I met that fiend in the twilight mists. That's where the master you're about to fight trained. Habek, the first sword of Changun. You should seek him out. He might know more. Still not enough training. He seems a bit stiff after our fight. Hmm. Gunga is definitely one of the most noteworthy warriors in Annika. Well, yes. He stays too to the warrior's path, refusing to be swayed by demonic temptation. But of course, he's not as skilled as you, Bittervine, my steadfast warrior. Teehee! Oh, I think she's trying to flirt. I sure am proud to be your assistant for the tournament. I did notice that Gumga was striking with more ferocity than usual. I hope you weren't hurt. Well, I, I did get my hit points knocked down a bit, but otherwise I'm fine. Now, you are about to fight your ninth and final opponent. His name is Habek, and he only recently gained fame in Annika. He is said to possess powerful shape-shifting abilities. He may also be one of the people connected to the demons, right? Maybe he's the source of the suspicious energy. We should inform Pahan. Sure. To me, my unicorn. Off to Pahan. Habek. Okay. Before he became a shapeshifter, he studied under Sidereal Sien in Prisma Valley. But he wasn't chosen to be the Sidereal's successor. His younger brother Wei was chosen instead. I heard he left Prisma Valley afterward. Oh no, is jealousy why he colluded with demons? If that theory is true, we have a considerable problem. I'll send my students after him. Could you also travel to the Twilight Mists? Havoc, why did he... Alright. Twilight Mists through the Melody Forest, huh? Let's see, uh, Melody Forest. Ah, there we are. 
So let's transport over there to save me a lot of running. Alas, we'll see less of the unicorn, but... Alright, let's go over this way, and I notice that there is a quest up here. As I ignore all sorts of various things, but I won't ignore... stuff. Put the harp out. Fire my laser. Despair at how little damage I've been doing. Oh, attract another one. Okay, let's put the ego back out. Come on, just die, please. I asked nicely. Ah, there we go. I've heard there's a monument somewhere inside the Melody Forest that's made of gold. And it shines beautifully when the sun sets. It's got to be hidden somewhere around here. Honorary Hunter, how'd you like to look for it with us? Sure. It's not like I have better things to do right now. Let's see. Ah, okay. If I go this way... Sunset reflected off the tower does indeed look like gold. Oh! Alright, I'm leaving. I'm continuing to leave. It just looks golden in the rays of the setting sun? Then it's worthless. Oh, for crying out loud. That is a lot of my HP that suddenly vanished. Alright, what? It just looks golden in the rays of the setting sun? Then it's worthless. The people of Annika are really imaginative, comparing the dusky color of the tower to gold. We don't need silly stories like that. We'll just leave that to the archaeologists. No comment? Alright. Let's go up the cliffs. And into the twilight forest mists, the twilight mists. Do you know the legend of the sage herb? It's believed to have amazing healing properties and to be eaten by mountain deities. I wish this mythical plant really existed. I could treat the mother of the kid who keeps coming to ask for my help lately. Okay, sure, uh, but I'm just going to look at this vista before I do that. Oh, man, this game is pretty. Oh, 
Okay, continuing onwards. The men uh, ran down uh, that way. Something serious happened. You want to follow them, don't you? You'd better watch where you're going. People go missing from here all the time. What with the everlasting fog and the winding road, it's easy to fall to your death if you're not careful enough. Several people have gone missing just recently, too. Those poor souls. I find it difficult to make the noise that that NPC just made on command, so I'm just gonna skip it. Sorry. Alright, hi-ho me! Away! Don't venture into the cave. Angry goats. Lots of angry goats. We're angry goats. Now they're ex goats. Gathered at the shelter over there. Gathered at the shelter, huh? Okay. Oh. All right. More goats. was fast. All right, continuing onwards. Careful, one wrong. I have no idea how that one got so injured, but I am definitely going to take advantage of it. I'll... And I will take those flowers. Wonder if I'll find something rare today. And grab this triport. Oh, I love the dragons. All right. Pass through here. It's very foggy, so be sure to watch your step. All there right. From areas with heavy fog. I was chasing the demon's trail until I lost it in the fog. Then I stopped to rest for a while. The others went ahead without me, and I don't know where they are now. Frankly, I'm worried about them. People going missing in the mists is all too common. Locals said I could ask Jangman for help, but I don't know where he is either. Okay. The sage herb? If that herb really existed, this would be the perfect place for it to grow. But there's a reason it's a mythical herb. It either doesn't exist or it's extremely rare. I've never seen that herb in my life, so you're probably wasting your time. It's just the stuff of legend. If you still want to look for it, then talk to the mountain geezer. He's not all there in the head, but he can be useful sometimes. All right, I'll just uh, take this tree. It's my tree now. All mine, mine, all mine. This is the last time I take this road. There we go. Let's get back on the unicorn. Ride over to whatever all is going on here. Take out this bird. So that I can talk to this NPC. Oh, this place is very mysterious and there's mist everywhere. Look at those big, big birds. I have a feeling there's something special about their eggs. I'd love to get my hands on those eggs. Uh. Okay. All right. I will. I will steal some bird eggs for you, sir. A 
big smelly egg inside. All right. Delivery. Oh, is this the egg of an Annika bird? It's so big and heavy. Wow, even the eggs in Annika are mysterious. Everything here is so new to me. I just got three skill points. Which means I can raise another skill, maybe? Hmm. Well, you know what? Let's let's make the ego harp stronger. Because Okay. Continuing on through all this mess. Young clan? Jock clan? <laughs> Whatever. I've never seen them before. Anyway, I've seen some interesting things these past few days. Shh, no one else is around, right? There's a master who creates phantoms, bewitching people. He shows up from the mist and vanishes back into it. Shh. Eh? Isn't this surprising? Hmm. Come on! Can you at least act surprised? Alright, show surprise. Act startled? Oh my goodness, you've told me something. You've told me nothing. <laughs> Are you surprised too? He's the culprit. He's the one behind the phantoms. Okay. He bewitches people. Between his summoning magic and his hatred, he's going to make quite the mark on Annika. Hee <laughs> hee! He has set up shop in the cave created by a mountain deity. Valley Lead? Yes, Valley Lead knows him. He knows everyone. You better take those marionette feet. Valley Lead will need them. Trust me. Now go away. Shoo! Er, shoo. All right, then I ask him about the mystical herb. Of course I do. Mountain deities eat that herb. Munch, munch, like this. But I'm not going to tell you where it is without something in return. Bring me horned beasts' feces. I'll tell you if you bring it. <laughs> what? What do you want with dung, sir? You do not have a garden. There's no garden. What do, what do you need dung for? Oh well, let's let's go get some dung. Man, these things just they, they do not like to give up. Eat my ego! There we go! Alright, some dung. Some more. What could this possibly be used for? All right, back uphill. Leave me alone, bad goat. They're round and delicious looking. <laughs> they taste good if you mix them with water. Ugh. Ask the little boy about the sage herb. The charm maker student should know. Okay, um, I don't normally like to use this one outside of Among Us, but sus. Alright, let's, let's get back on the horse. 
grab this triport. Murder some marionettes. Cut down a tree while I'm here. leveled up. Nice. All right, riding, riding. Oh, it's creepy here. Oh, Makoko. Excuse you. gather my Mokoko. They are dejected. Jangman must have played a prank again. Yeah. You can leave the wooden doll foot. Jangman is a lot of things, but a liar isn't one of them. The cave made by a mountain deity has to mean Nimbus Cavern. He must have seen something in there. That's also where the students of the Yan and Jock clans went off to. It's surrounded by a suspicious mist. You should head there now and investigate. Meanwhile, I'll go and inform Wei in Prisma Valley of this. Woohoo! Level up! All right. I'm a raisin my laser. And then I'm talking to Wu Yi. My teacher told me sage herbs grow in a cave somewhere in the twilight mists. I don't know exactly which cave it is. There is a cave nearby. Why don't you investigate it first? Okay. I'm just going to make a quick side trip. Let's put down the ego harp. Let's fire my laser. I shouldn't have gone this way. All right, continuing onwards. I see a quest down here. go. All right, what quest do you have for me, sir? I've been seeing heretics inside the cave more often lately. I don't care what they do in here, but it upsets me that they keep chasing fish away. Would you go ask them to keep it down? This is my house, so they should keep it quiet. Okay. Let's see. Oh, I, get, I lose a lot of swiftness by doing this. Excuse you, rude. I was looking at my inventory. I did not even look in your direction. You should be ashamed. What all is going on down here? Defeat red shamans and mages. Oh, like that guy. Ooh, a new harp.
Oh, of course. Spiders. It had to be spiders. Why would it be anything other than spiders in a cave? They will turn Annika into hell on Earth. Okay, that, that bodes not well. Let's see, more marionettes. Oh, well, that's one of the dudes I'm supposed to fight, but he's uh, going the other way. The demons travel to the bleak edge. Okay. <laughs> Did Orang take shelter? Whoops. Didn't mean to actually hit those, but... Okay, I'll just, uh... Halbeck made a deal with a demon named Vicus. Okay... Going up. Haha, -ha, you can't shoot up. I mean, neither can I, but haha, -ha, you can't shoot up. Alright, read that into the inventory. Uh, Habeck, I thought he was a demon. Ooh. By the time we arrived, it was too late. Habak sold his soul to the demons. For near unlimited power, the demons headed to Bleak Edge. If they offer the eyes and the heart to the Hellspawn, then all of Annika will be... Ugh, please go to the Foul Hollow. There, in the depths, the source of power that Habak received from the demons. The seal stones, the spirits must be released. Ah, uh, ah, I feel my life force waning. Please, stop them. For Annika. Okay. Off I go, I guess. If I go, yeah, if I go this way. Oh, of course. Okay. Exterminate spiders, it says, and exterminate spiders, I will. Wait a minute, those aren't spiders. Here, spiders. Here, spiders, 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 spiders. Where are all the spiders? Stop following me. I'm trying to find spiders. Spiders. Is there really only one cluster of spiders in the whole place? Oh, there's more spiders. 
Oh, they were all up here, I see. Where they're going to be a nuisance. Honorary hunter, please go in there and look for Hegel and Anchan. We found treasure, but a big spider showed up and attacked us. I ran until I got outside, but the other two must still be in there. Okay. Come to think of it, where is the cave that I'm supposed to check for the herb? Maybe it's up here? Oh, no, wait, it's both investigate the evil cave. It's in here. All right. In I go. Oh, what a charming place. Strangely purple clouds aren't concerning at all. Breathing stopped due to hallucinatory mist. Okay, wait until the mist down there clears, then go. Whoop, no, no, not into the mist. Okay, I want to go this way. Oh, no, no, not the mist, not the mist. Could this be the legendary grass? All right, collect sage herb in the evil cave, and what do I do with this? I've activate the seal stones where the mist can't reach. Okay. Um... This way, oh, no, no, bad mist, bad mist. No cookie. Okay, as soon as the mist clears. Oh, blasted little creatures. Girl can't get anything done around here. Okay, stand on this side of the mist and activate the stone. Take an HP potion. What the? No! Okay. Whoop, whoop. No, this way. No, not the mist again. Come on, mist. Clear up, clear up. Ego and laser! My egotist laser. New combo.
darn it, I, I need to go this way. going to give up this treasure. It took forever to find it. Okay. Oh, blast. I shouldn't have come down here yet. Oh, ow, 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 ow. Stay out of the mist. I'm not going to touch the chest. All the chests that I've ever encountered around these places have been trapped. little spider. All right. Got that one. Okay, I need to go this way. Oh, gross. Ego? Poison! Yes, I'd been noticing. I, I had been noticing. Okay, and oof. Okay, through here. For crying out loud. so that I may live. Bless, they used up all the time that it was outside of the mist. Okay, I'll get it this time. Got it. Which Who blew up something? Intrude on the master's sacred grounds. <sighs> A disgusting insect. <sighs> Great. I don't know what you are, but you need to go, sir. This place is very small. Ah, uh, no. this area so small
have my heart. Let's scoot in between all of this. Yes, eat my laser! Whoop! He nearly got me there. Master's power Got him. only grows. I got him and it was good. And I got new pants. Well, they look exactly the same as the old pants, so... And some new earrings, maybe? Oh, crit. Uh, yeah, not, not that interesting, sorry. Well, time to go. Heck, all is happening down here. Well, I'll let the bot uh, so take care of it. You're the the master told me about. I'm way. Hi. I came here as soon as I talked to him. And it seems you already took care of the situation. So, what happened inside there? Habak stole people's souls. Brother Habak did? Did he really do that? I heard he was back, but I was oblivious to what was happening outside Prisma Valley. I'll look around here and take care of the victims. Please, go report this to the leader. Now, I saw a bit of green behind the leader. Does that mean that there's a Mokoko hiding back here? No. No, there's just a green spot on the wall to fool me. Hegel died and Anshan wouldn't leave the treasure? Anshan, that idiot. He's going to kill himself over some treasure. I'm out. I'd rather give up treasure than die. I can't entirely disagree with that. All right, return to Sir Valley Lead. Departing through the massive numbers of spiders, continuing to depart, departing as hard as I can. I am not going to stop for that boss thing this time, because it's just too crowded around here. I just don't want to deal with it. So let's just head on over. So that's what happened in the cave. Yep. Habak used them to augment his power. Wei will make sure the evil energy in the cave is extinguished. To evoke such a forbidden spell, Habak must have received aid from demons. Now that we've killed the corrupted Girapati, Habak's power should be weakened. Okay, that sounds like it makes sense. But you still need to be prepared for his malicious magic. I'll make you a charm imbued with my energy. But I do need two things. Bring me some cliff herb roots and horned beast blood. Okay. Little dog going absolutely mad outside my window. very careful because a zone boss can appear yeah oh oh he's here yeah I, I don't want anything to do with him I 
I mean, if I'm careful, I can show y'all. Behold, Chuo. He's a dog dragon. But yeah, I can't I can't fight him solo and trying to drag him into the bots is a losing proposition. If so. you use the charms I made for you, suppressing Hobak's phantom should be easy. Alright. Overpower overpower Hobak and find out where the demons are. He won't confess easily. But we must do whatever we can to retrieve the Hellspawn's stolen eyes and heart. All right, time to return to Chang'un, which I think will be easier if I transport. It will certainly be faster. to start with the side quest over here is there a discount is this the sage herb it matches the description Lee Kang gave me but both the shape of its roots and leaves look right I'll make a medicine with these herbs who grind this ingredient into powder tie them into single doses like this now, please this give this to the child, Soso. Okay, give it to the child. Can this medicine cure my mom? Thank you so much. Now I don't have to worry about losing my mom. Thank you. I'll never forget this. And this vitality increase will never forget you. Hari is my favorite. All right, time to fight Habak. Win, defeat all. Unbelievable! That strange energy belonged to Habak. How could he sacrifice others for power? People like him must be reported to the authorities and punished. The tournament management committee will decide his fate. Until then, I leave him to you, Bittervine. I hope you manage to hold out until Pahan arrives. This time, I'm worried about your safety. Please come back alive and victorious. All right, here goes. I'll pray for your victory. I'll pray for my victory, too. Show us what you're capable of. Hush, Marshal. And now, time to the fight me a demon man. The arena for the final match. Their opponent, none other than the first sword of Chang Hu. Would not expect to lose the source. You can of say my that power. this is the blooming moment of the two-week-long Chang Hu I'll tournament. Down. Please give a huge round of applause for our I'll challengers. Well, that's just cheating. I'll show you the true power of an illusionist. I still say that's cheating. I can't read your comment right at the moment, Green. But welcome to the stream. You seem to have arrived just in time. There he goes. 
those. Mobile little thing, isn't he? you're gonna stand still and you know do that weird paper thing Keep getting caught in those. Well, he didn't eat all of it, but he at least ate some of it. Here, have my heart. Darn it, I missed. by laser Ladies and gentlemen, do you believe in <laughs> What a day for the Chang Hoon tournament. Say hello to our new hero. I am the champion, my friends. his assets the gates of hell will soon consume Annika that's enough brother hey wait Okay. The demon man who lives on Drury Lane, huh, Green? His spells are imbued with impure energy. Elder brother, why did you choose this path? Havoc must have summoned up all his remaining energy and gone to the Twilight Mists. We must stop him before it's too late. Head to the mists immediately. Okay, did I get any equipment out of that? No. At some point I got another grenade, but uh, that doesn't actually... Alright, so... Let's see... If I go here, it 
It's messy over here. I'm a go. Oh, hey, that's a Makoko seed. Maybe I won't go so far. Coco seed. Come to think of it, I probably didn't get this. No, I'm pretty sure I didn't get this vista. Omnimnius music. Let's head in. The bleak entrance is this way. Mm hmm. You okay? I'm fine. This is his barrier. Stand back. Okay. Pop it like a bubble, way. Don't show this. Damn it. Go on ahead. I'll be right behind you. I'm okay. Are you sure? You might have overdone it there a little. Okay. Let's go fight a hellspawn, shall we? This place where I have to at least pretend I have patience from time to time. All right, eliminate corpse soldiers. Most of those appear to be dead now. Okay, that takes care of them. Let's just cover the pile. Get out of the poison. That that was a lot all at once. Let's just give my cooldowns a moment. Okay, there we go. for all of you. Man, they are still alive. Harp. Let's give it a bit more marching. I've nearly got it.
Man, I hate opponents that don't stagger. All right, let's put on the headpiece since that increases my stats. I guess take the strength ether, even if it probably won't last to the next set of mobs. Hit them with the laser! And they're still not dead. Oh man, why don't they die? How dare they not respect my authority? Go harp. Have some more dot damage. More dots, more dots, more dots. Ha! <laughs> okay. Okay, I have to make sure to not get run over with the eel by the eel things. And I honestly don't remember which of the eels repeat and which ones are just single shots, so... have this defense orb. Right, just kill everything that moves. That's that's the new normal. Go down the spiral hell. All right. Defeat fiend, fiends in the sp de de eliminate fiends in the spiral hell. Okay. Continuing. Whoops. I pressed the wrong button. got run over by an eel thing. Does that eel repeat? Yes, that eel repeats. Pity. The eel does not actually injure those guys. All right, let's see. Whoop, eel thing.
Okay, across to here. Oh. Wait. Do those ones not move? Okay. I remember, I remember that the eel things, but I don't remember which ones are which. Alright, let's put down the ego harp. Let's do this thing. Give myself some shielding. Use some homing missiles. Fire my laser. Eat the recovery orb. Okay, progress. Progress has been made. And we wait for them to come to me. We fire the laser into the lot of them. And then we'll use the shieldy thing on the ones that are left. Saw, oh, yeah, I saw a couple of pieces of equipment. All right. Moi, better stuff. Is that eel going anywhere? No, okay. Oh, those eels are going places, though. Make it to the bottom of the spiral hell. Okay. Oh, that was a big pile of stuff. Anything useful? Um, hmm. Not exactly. That's pity. Okay. Up the rock. Too late. The hellspawn is mine now. Soon, Kazaros will return. Oh, great! Still need to stop her. Come on, fire it in the correct direction, game. I won? I think I won. And without dying. Pay 
patience, patience. I will certainly take that recovery ether. Thank you. Okay. The music is getting more and more anx anxiety producing here. This video contains flashing images. Viewer discretion is advised. Well... <gasps> Feeling pretty okay today. The hell spawn. How exciting. You didn't forget our deal, did you? <laughs> of course. <clears throat> what are you doing? <clears throat> you wanted to become part of the hell spawn, did you? <clears throat> <laughs> we have another sacrifice. You clearly have a death wish. Very well, I believe I shall oblige you. Make it quick, won't you, Banda? <laughs> oh, those are definitely some flashing images there. Yep, mm-hmm. a good head day. Alright. Start simply. Get the dots going. Feel lucky that he's missed me so f Feet! energy shield. Destroy the Ebon Nether Spears to break his shield. Spears. Okay. Um. Wow. Oh, I see. Okay. friends are pretty much invisible and I do not appreciate it. Ah! Okay, um, that obviously was not a skill that did what I wanted it to do. like it here. This place is way too stark for me. Vanda activated his energy shield. Destroy the Ebon Nether Spears to break his shield. Oh no, I hate 
eat it. Oh, please. Oh, give me give me the rest of my colors back. Oh, this is awful. At least that labyrinth last night had some sort of contrast. got, like, prevented it that time. Almost. Ow. So there. It was meant to be a gift for Master Kazaros. But this insect has ruined everything! <laughs> the stench of death that consumed Annika was your doing. Vicus of the <laughs> Avarice Legion. <laughs> you... that power! Oh my... You're one of these Siderials. Perfect timing. Without its master, this realm will collapse. Why don't you join them? <laughs> this place is falling apart. Uh oh. We must get out of here. Now. We'll meet again if we're meant to. Yeah, um, sure. Can't use that here, huh? All right, time to go. Leaving, leaving, exiting, getting out of this place. All right, can I open it now? Yes. Another new harp, excellent. And a ring. Ooh, I like that ring. I'll wear that. Well, what became of the Hellspawn and Habeck? The demons? Well, it's a bit of a long story. It seems I can finally rest easy. Thank you. Haha. <laughs> Way headed out to Prisma Valley. He looked troubled. I hope nothing is amiss. In any case, I'm glad that everything has been resolved. You saved all of Annika today, Bittervine. I hope you realize how much you've done. Now, please return to Chang'un and share this momentous news. I'll close the barrier and then confer with Sir Druden. The boundary is closing. Ooh, all sorts of stuff just happened. I'll take that card. I'll take these cards. What do we got here? An epic and an uncommon. Okay. A Titulus card. And... A Favreau card. Okay. And I can level up another skill. In fact, I have enough points to bring a skill to level 10. The boundary is Ooh. closing. You know what? I use this one the most often. Okay, so Pain Brand, damage increase rises from 12.5% to 60%, or 
melody increase. On hit, Serenade my meter gains 200%. Hmm. These are both tempting things. These are both very tempting things. You know what? You can reset skills, so... If I remember to switch it for dungeons... Well, I'm gonna take the pain brand for now. I got an achievement for mastery. The boundary is closing. Yes, yes, I'm, I'm sure it is. Forest of Giants. Okay, that's that's back with on um, Mokoko Island. However, oh, this this one is real close. All right, twenty steps to the north, huh? No, I don't want to go into the dungeon. Twenty steps to the northwest. Southeast. Okay, it must it must be down in that little. All right, let's let's leap down. Oh, yep, there it is. Let's see if I can get some better jewelry. Oh wait, that's a Makoko seat. That's not actually the dungeon. Ten steps to the west. To the northeast. Okay, 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 fine. I'm glad to have gotten the Makoko seed, but this is getting silly. Alright, so what if I... It's, it's right around here somewhere, isn't it? Wait a minute, there it is! Into the secret dungeon! Nice place, seems to be full of dogs. my melody meter doesn't really mean much to me since I almost never use the special skill that the bard has. It's only really useful in parties. And even then, it's just... frustrating. It sort of sounds like she just said dog sit there. Okay, any more animals? Nope, okay. Oh, a healing potion, nice. Mitch, the drops mobs do not drop stuff often, so I'm always thankful to see them drop something. Okay, so let's see how this pain meter thing... Of course, he won't stay in it long enough for me to find out. You know what? Eat ego. There we 
go. Okay, so did I get anything good? Not really. I could give up some swiftness for endurance and domination. Why not? Let's just stuff that up there for reasons. Okay. Let's leave. And figure out where the other one is. 100 steps to the south. Is okay, I, I don't want to go into that dungeon. I'm... Oh, I see, I see. Okay, go up here. Go around here. You know what? Stop. Stop for this primrose. Keep going, keep going. Over here, over there, around here. Over this way. Nice place. Secret dungeon. Okay. Much smaller than the previous one. Still full of dogs. I'm just gonna clear out this way first. Just so these things aren't showing up to nom on my backside while I'm fighting the boss. Have, have some ego. Aw, oh, man. He dodged it completely. Ran straight into my laser, though, so at least there's that. Awesome? No, not really, but... Still, took care of that. I gotta admit that this place looks like some place I might find a vista or a mococo seed or or a secret. No, 
Nothing? Nothing at all? How disappointing. Oh well. Wait a minute. You know what? I'm gonna go to Prisma Valley. There isn't actually anything in the main story quest to take me there, but if I remember correctly, there's at least one triport. So to get... So to get completion... Oh, there's two triports in there. To get completion on the triports here. You know what? I'll take that card. Thank you. And I'm going to go through and dissolve a pile of equipment. That and that and that, 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 that thing, that and that, 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 and this. What can I not... Was it the pants? Why? I hate this new thing. There's this whole thing about saved presets, and it automatically thinks that your equipment is a saved pre- like, the equipment that you have equipped is, is a saved preset, it thinks. And it won't let you dissolve it. Even though it's not equipped anymore. Just sticks you with the stuff in the inventory. I will worry about all this cruft later. Really need to go commune with my bank at some point in the future, but I'm fine so far. It's fine. It's not fine, but I'm going to claim that it is. Oh, I got a title. What title did I get? Strategist. Switch to skill tree level three. Okay, so that's where I got the two points of wisdom somehow. And card catalog. I've got a bunch of new cards. I'm not going to look at the ones. This is the one that's important to me. Oh, look at that. I completed a book. Guardian of Chang Hun, which has given the roster strength, dexterity, and intelligence plus six. Gotten really close to completing this one. Close to this one. Far, far away from this one. Halfway on this one. Kind of far away on this one. But still, finished a book. Mwahaha! And let's check. Okay, I still have lots of space down here. Alright. Alright. We ride to Prisma Valley. Oh, come on. Just leave me alone. going to go to Prisma Valley and get the triports there, and I think there's one or two quests there to do as well. So that too. Leave me alone, good boys! Bitter don't want to play with you. Yep, 
see, lovely place. Quest right here. Hello, you just wandered into Prisma Valley, haven't you? I saw you from afar. I wonder if Destiny had a hand in our meeting. Let's find out. Why don't you try and lift and move that stone... Dokakabi? Dokabi? Dokabi? The stone thing! All right, pick up the statue, carry it over here. Realize that my gloves really don't go with the rest of my outfit now. Oh boy, does that stand out. Ah, you moved the stone thingamabob, which proves you have the making of a master. How would you like to train in Prisma Valley and become a master of the arts? Um, nice talking to you. Bye bye. I get that. Ooh, Vista. Oh, what the heck is going on down there? Back on the unicorn. I love my unicorn. I sense demonic energy somewhere near. Something strange is going on in Prisma Valley. Whoop! Are you kidding me? Take a powder! Something strange is going on in Prisma Valley. Rainless lightning struck. Followed by the faint screams of fiends. Wei's home is nearby. I am worried about his safety. Okay. So... Let's head over here. Check out what's going on. To the way, residents! Because I know the way. Hello, it's full of demons. I don't I don't respect little knifey boys enough to use major skills on them. The the extra damage that this thing does now is amazing. Okay, continuing onwards. I thought I heard Dotro's voice. So many have gathered here. Come out! Don't man. hold back! One left! Killed my master, the demon Dochul. 
Destiny has joined our two paths. Uh... Thank you for stopping those fiends. I sense a rare and special power in you. The shrines, you say? I am the only one who can control them. But am I still capable of such a feat? Yes, I can do it if you help me. What you just saw was Dochul the Immortal, a fiend that once brought chaos to the world. One of my ancestors trapped Dochul and saved the realm, and I have inherited the an this ancestral power. However, I have not been skilled enough to control the power. That's why I've locked myself up here. Perhaps you're strong enough to augment my limited skills. Before you head out to the shrines, could you help me to properly contain Dochul? Thank you. You're a true hero. Let's travel to the ritual site. I'm such a hero that my Dochul yes is, is assumed. Spirit, handed down to each generation of the heirs of Sua. All right, heading to the right. Well, now they're dead. All right, continuing onwards. My family and I was not worthy of Dojo. In shame, I secluded myself in Prisma Valley. Soon, we will be at the ritual site. Okay. Are we not going to get attacked again? Okay. what he started and defeat you now you go now all right all right all right okay that would have stung if i hadn't had the shield how about an ego I don't think I want to step in the purple fire. Whoop, no, don't step in the purple fire. No matter how pretty it is, it's not a good idea. Here, let's let's have another ego harp. Whoop, whoop. Oh, ow, 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 ow. Ah, oh, didn't stay in that very long, did he?
accepted your fate. Now, go forth into the wider world. Fight against evil and find the light. That is the path for you and the world. Okay. I believe that I win. And that over there is a rabbit. I'll just be gathering that. Yep. Okay. Thank you. Thanks to you, my succession has been completed safely. Now that I have full control over my left arm, I'm going to work and help save the world, just like my teacher did. Thyrene? Ah, I see. That descendant of Lutera is gathering people. If we have the same goal, perhaps we'll cross paths again sometime. Where are you going now? Another continent to find an ark. I have a feeling that we'll meet again. Until then, good luck. Noise. Ah, did I get anything equipable? I did not. All right. If I head down over this way, whoop, this way, that way, I'll, I'll skip that. Over here. I don't especially want to fight the foxes for reasons that should be obvious to those who are watching the channel. <laughs> I really miss food from the outside world. If I could have just one bite of proper food, I'm tired of pine leaves and dew. Hoden, who's being punished, who's being punished over there, has a packed lunch in his bag. Please, I beg you, let me at least smell that food. This seems like a terrible idea. I'll do it. Oh, you're a visitor here. What brings you? Say, if you're not busy, how would you like to dump out that leaf bag for me? I overturn that bag so many times a day that I feel as if I'm being punished along with Hoden. <laughs> Alright, I will do that in a moment, but first... There we go. All the triports and Annika. And a stolen lunch. Okay, let's let's grab a oh. Okay, that was the 90th time. Just 10 more times for the day. You can't leave until you're done. Let's see. I'm thinking about what to make him do after he's done sweeping. How about polishing each and every pebble on the on the temple grounds? Ha ha ha. All right, I'll just, I'll take that card and I'll open this. Uncommon. All right, open that. Phantom Bishop, which I already had. Okay. Spicy smelling stir fried beef, a perfect combination of peppers and bean sprouts. <gasps> Is this liquor I'm smelling? I'm sorry to do this to Hoden, but I have to taste these. 
I can't stop drilling. And you know, now I can do rapport with him. I'll agree that it was right for him to steal that lunch. Yep, you should have done that. And I can't play him the song he wants because I don't have it. Well, I guess that's it then. Let's see. Oh, there's still a quest. Stop running like a pleb, woman. Get on your unicorn. Those who let their minds wander during training often get stuck in the form of whatever animal they have taken. Use a bamboo broom to help those who haven't returned to their original form. Sure! You have a strong build. I want you to help my students practice their spells. They've never used their spells on people before, so be prepared. This seems like a terrible idea, sir. Yeah, okay. What about you? Oh, that one was pretty. Okay, and down here... You seem stuck. Uh, you might be stuck. Flamingos, huh? Okay, that takes care of that. Back on the unicorn. Haha, <laughs> when you start thinking you might be stuck in animal form forever, you just need a reality check. Just try again, and you should do better next time. Thank you for helping my students. My students might have been overly enthusiastic. You couldn't have stood your ground if it weren't for your strong build. I hope it was a good lesson for you, too. Sure, why not? I'll just, uh, read that into my inventory. Okay, and that is it for the quests here. So, back to Changun, I think. Man, I hope I get a new shirt soon. This one really doesn't go with my pants or my gloves. You have saved Annika. You're the winner of the tournament and the savior of Annika. Thank you. You have no idea how worried I became after speaking with Pahan. This is truly extraordinary. Oh, that's right. You took off for the Twilight Mists right after the tournament, didn't you? This is no way to treat the first sword of Chang'un. Everyone's waiting for you. Come on, let's go to the arena. Look, everyone! The hero of the day makes an appearance! Oh? Uh, <laughs> we haven't had a hero like this in quite some time! That's right. Let's give him a round of applause! Hero of Annika. You've done a masterful job. I'd like to thank you on behalf of the Yons. So, you came to Annika looking for the Ark, right? 
I found a document related to it. A long time ago, the two halves of this document were entrusted to the Jans and Jocks. You'll be able to read it if you combine this half with the Jocks half. Please, go to zone. That was a load off my mind. All of Annika is in your debt. Martial arts are remarkable. And it's Hari. Bittervine, why didn't you attend the banquet? I waited for you. Where were you during the tournament? It was impossible to get a chance to talk to you. Actually, I watched you during the tournament, Bittervine. When we fought, I felt that you were special. I was so amazed by you that I stayed and watched every single one of your matches. I've got a fan! I looked forward to talking to you at the banquet. Anyway, since you skipped the banquet, I'd like to invite, invite you over to my salon. I'd love to treat you to a feast. Come to think of it, your other opponents wanted to see you too. Some of them haven't left Chang'un yet. Why don't you meet them? Oh, oh Annika, here I think of your debt. Sure, why not? Let's see. Right or left? Left or right? On your success. Congratulations right. on a huge win. Help yourself to the food and all right, all right, all right. Going over here. Did you defeat the Hellspawn? That should have been the Jock Clan's triumph. Well, you guys kind of got your asses kicked because you kept sending students instead of the masters. That's not my fault. Well, next time it will be. You're here for the scroll, aren't you? Combine it with the yawns, and you'll be able to read what's written in them. Go on, combine them. Fine. Alright, and read it. Okay, gotta lean forward, small print. The long war is finally over, but this peace won't last long. We know this, be we know this because of the hellspawn that crawled out of the rift. I hope you'll lead Annika wisely. Now, my duty is to safely hand over to future generations the seed of hope and ambition that my old comrades and I shared. I can't leave the Ark and its great power in Annika, not so long as my unstable flesh contains this hellspawn. Hope brings ambition, and ambition begets hope, but I pray no one will get hurt. My old friends and I have decided to hide it in the arid red desert Arthatine and the Cursed Land. Sidereal Sien Hmm, I see. The scroll left by Shin was written in old Annika. Shin? I'll translate it for you. Let's see. This long, the long war is finally over, but this peace won't last long. Isn't this what I already read? We know this because of the hellspawn that crawled out of the rift. I hope you'll lead Annika wisely. Yeah, this is exactly what I just read to all y'all. I'm just gonna keep going through it, because I already read all that. This means you'll have to go to Arthatine. The White Wind should be ready by now. I want you to take the ship with you. You're the hero of Enica. You deserve a ship that's just as special as you. Now, off you go. I got a new ship! I am also not leaving yet. I still have at least one side quest to complete in here. This lovely purple one, rain, no stars, too. wind. Congratulations on the win. huge win. Defeat all of them. I did defeat all of them. Thank you. That's the one I knew Did you see him? All right. Inside. Whoop. Okay, I thought I missed the door, but apparently not. Is our food coming yet? Yeah, yeah, it's One foe! One of my brothers told me Havoc was the culprit, huh? I can't believe a master did such a terrible thing. What happened afterward? 
This is a long story that I'm going to tell him very briefly. There's a lot of side boob in this shirt, I suddenly realize. Hmm, I see. The Hellspawn. You even went to the Bleak Edge? You're more amazing than I thought. Ha! Huh, it'll take me years to become strong enough to beat you. I'm going back to the Yawns, thanks to Pahan. He forgave all my transgressions. Now that my wife is doing better, I don't have to gamble anymore. I'm going to start training again to become as strong as you. Ha ha! Ah, uh, I didn't mean to take up so much of your time. You came to see Manpo, right? He's in the kitchen. I'd better go give these dumplings to Suryon. I hope we'll meet again, and when we do, I want a rematch. And I don't want you to go easy on me. That can probably be arranged. Manpo! Ah, Bittervine, you beat me. You beat Gumga and Habak too, right? I guess I would have lost, no matter how many of my dumplings I ate. Ha 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 ha! I wanted to tell you this at the banquet, but you never showed up. This, uh, isn't your first time being in my kitchen, is it? After our match, Wubu, Wubo confessed how he made you do things for him. Because of that, Bittervine, I'll let you eat my dumplings for free. Come eat them whenever you like. They're right over there, so be sure to eat some before you leave. Hey! Let's, let's eat a dumpling that's bigger than my head. Yes, let's do that. Take a bite of the tasty looking dumpling. Delicious. Uh, look for one hand in the arena. Hey, I can pick this up. Oh yeah, I can, I can take more bites. <laughs> that's great. Okay. To the arena! Putin still needs to train a lot. That's the one who All right, me. back to the arena. Win! Defeat all of them! Congratulations on the huge... Congratulations on your success. Hold on. Okay, straight through. Martial arts are remarkable. Yeah, straight through and then over here. Yeah. Oh, Bittervine, you came at the right time. You need to join the Battle of Lions with me. Because you exposed Miru's identity, she can't keep this date with me. I look forward to spending some quality time with a beautiful woman. Bah! Come on, put on that mask. We don't have much time left. Ready? Sure, okay. Nice, let's go. Okay, this is a bit of ridiculousness. Then let the battle of the lions begin. Sure. Chung Hoon Lions have arrived! We're just gonna assume that the big guy is the one in the back of my dragon. Lion. Dragon. Lion? He's the rear feet. A sharp attack! Let's breathe some fire! Alright, the trick is to gather up your enemies and just defeat them. Hey, wait a minute. Somebody's cheating. How dare! Round and round and round, baby push the monkey, chase the weasel. Come 
on, guys. Get together, get together, get together. Fire! Aren't there more? Oh, just three? Okay. Whoops. Missed a couple. Archers. Whoa, what a bold move. What does this do? Oh, it's a guard. Okay. I'm going to win despite other people cheating. Some of these uh, blue ones seem to be up chucking darts. Okay, defeat the black lion. That's a bunch of the white lions taken care of. Take the figurine of... Oh, oh, just, okay. The person who takes the statue wins. Okay, as much as he probably spent the entire match with his face in my backside, he was excellent back legs. Give a round of applause to the new cub for its impressive performance. participating in a tournament. Good thing it's team buns for dinner rather than chili. I'm not sure if they have chili on this I continent. I wish oh, we had it's really strong. I bet Monpo is stronger though. Uh, yeah. Hey, <laughs> you're the first sword of Chang'un for a reason. See how the other lions gave us a wide berth? I'm the best when it comes to the battle of the lions. Ah, uh, it would have been perfect if I became the first sword too. <laughs> I'm going to Arthatine to replace my other arm with a machine, too. Really, sir? You don't need to do that. With two machine arms, I should be able to beat you. <laughs> Until then, stay safe. The person who just walked by looks really strong. I bet Monpo is stronger, though. Okay. Look for Gumga at the dock. All right, back to the unicorn. Is going to Not that dock. Special discount for the tournament. But uh, this dock. Hey, throw the rope here. Hi, Gunga. I thought it'd be nice to see you again. There aren't many warriors in this world who are as strong as you are. I lost for the first time in a long time. Our match made me think about many things. I counted how many worthy opponents I fought. I could count them on just one hand, so I decided to travel and look for new adversaries. Okay, uh, all right, I'm supposed to encourage him, so encourage. Thank you for your encouragement. For now, you should enjoy your victory. 
I look forward to meeting you again. Next time we meet, I'll be much stronger than I am now. You'd better not slack off on your training. I want our rematch to be more spectacular than the first one. I hope we'll meet again here. I'll be training hard in the meantime. Hey! Throw the rope here! Okay, and... All the way over on the other side of the city. Look, it's the champion clan. Become a friend. Hi ho, the unicorn! Away! Hurry, is my face up right there? Why weren't you at the awards? Is there a discount? Come on. And okay, yeah, the, up here, over here, and there. Are you still available. sulking in Stay here? King needs alpacas. You know, maybe... I do really like my unicorn, though. It's very sparkly. Master Gildo has returned to the Melody Forest. Perhaps he returned to Sir Druden. I'm supposed to go all the way... Okay, fine. Magic! Unicorns are sparky, but Apocryphorm is warm. Well, the next place I'm going is a desert, so I'm not sure that I need warm quite yet. What are you doing here? Did you come to gloat at me? Bah, I've heard everything. My master is really loud. When I was young, I wanted to be a hero like you. That was why I decided to learn to fight. For now, I'm cleaning liquor jars in a storage room, but... Yes, since you locked the stuffing out of me, I thought about many things. I was angry at first, but that passed. I reflected a bit on my life. How I wanted to learn to fight, what I wanted to do when I became a master. I went astray halfway through, but I'm back now. I think I made the right decision to return to the Master. I want a rematch soon, and I won't go down so easily the next time. By the way, as long as you're here, take some liquor with you, will, will you? Sir Valley Lead is here, and between him and my Master, they can drink more jars than I could ever clean in a day. <laughs> sure, okay, let's, let's carry... As long as I'm going in that direction, I will carry some booze. Talk to Sir Druden. Gildal has learned his lesson, hasn't he? Ha! So, the gourd bottle was quite useful. Alcohol can't possibly taste any better now that Gildal is here. So, it was Habak who sold his soul to the demons, wasn't it? I can't believe a master did such a thing. Still can't make that noise on demand, sorry. I wouldn't be drinking like this if the world wasn't so peaceful. This is all because of you, Bittervine. Ever since Bleak Edge was sealed, all traces of the demons have disappeared from the twilight mists. What challenge is there left for me? How can I prove myself any longer? It's clear that demons won't be coming near Annika anytime soon. Wei has safely inherited his power, and you're here to take the fun out of everything. Humph! <laughs> you're looking for your tournament opponents, aren't you? Well, Hodun is over at the Jock Clan training grounds. Go say hi. Ruin someone else's day. Dude! Okay, I will go to the cliff and then I will get on my unicorn. All right, going down. Mounting up. I ride. Nice place. 
Poof. I wondered who came to see me. So it was you. Since I lost you in the tournament, I haven't slept very well. I'm the eldest son, and I brought shame to my family. Now I have to be out in the training grounds like this. Well, at least I can practice my martial arts when I get bored. Damn it. Father told me what happened at the barriers of the families and in the twilight mists. You took care of what my family should have. So as much as I hate to say it, thank you. Hmm, say that again? Forget it. If you didn't hear it the first time, stop asking. Now go. I have to practice so I can beat you one day. You snotty little brat. Back to Chang'un. Okay, back to the arena. Congratulations on your success. Martial arts are remarkable. Oh, Bittervine, did you come to see me? Yes. I see. Actually, I was thinking about you, Bittervine. I think the Chang'an tournament was really special this time. A challenger who burst onto the scene became the first sword of Chang'un. I helped you investigate some suspicious people. Sedelia Wei showed up out of nowhere. Plus, your matches were thrilling to watch. I was rooting for you, but I was also in a constant state of worry. Thinking you might get hurt or not be able to dodge. Or something along those lines. <laughs> but after I realized how tough you are, I was able to let go of my worries and just enjoy watching you fight. Ah, yes, the tournament is over now. Bittervine, I had so much fun because of you. You're leaving for someplace else, right? Please, stay safe until the next tournament, and good luck reaching a higher level in your fighting. And, mm, if you're not busy... Uh... Drop by Chang'un sometimes! Ho-ho! Yes. I had fun. Farewell! See you again. I'll always be rooting for you. Oh, she's adorable. I'm a show her a talk emote. Well, all my achievements process. She just wants to talk. You come back to tell more stories about your adventures? Can I play you anything you'd like? No, because I don't have the Song of Resonance yet. You know, I think that's the next stop. The next stop is to get the Song of Resonance. Martial arts are remarkable. All right. Now, what I see here is that something at my stronghold completed. So I'm just going to, yeah, right here. Let's go back to the stronghold before I set sail for anywhere. You're back. I was waiting for you. There are matters that need your approval. You can go check them in the office. I intend to. I see. My dispatch completed. All right. I'll take all that, everything that just arrived, and send out on another mission. Let's see. What do I have the least of? 1381, 1390... 1340. All right, the green ones. Let's see if I can find a green quest, which is right up here at the top. All right. Off you go. And while I'm here, I can stash all this stuff. I'll stash this too since I'm not going to be able to use that. 
I don't know about all this jewelry, but uh, let's just, uh, let's dump the rocks in here to be dealt with later. And let's see if it will finally let me dismantle this stuff. Yes! Okay, I decline to think about the jewelry. Looks quite valuable, huh? Okay. And what is this? Upon use, register Lion Mask to the toy encyclopedia. It's an interactable toy. All right, fine, I'll do that. I have no idea what to do with it from there, but now it's done. We'll just compact that stuff to worry about later. And head back out. It's time to head to sea. My time to set sail. Get that cargo moving. Are you referring to me as cargo, sir? <laughs> You're here. How was Annika? First sword of Chong Hoon? Wow. There's something, Captain. It's one way of Our putting next it. Next destination is Arthatine, to the north. To get there, we'll have to pass through the dangerous sandstorm seas. But don't you worry. With skilled sailors, <laughs> hazardous waters are nothing to fear. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we want the white wind because that one deals with the whole... But... F sandstorm thing. And I'll put her in there. Put him in wow. there. Are we leaving now? We're going to change the sail because the plane sails are so boring. I think this ship looks really good with the orange sails, don't you? It goes with the trim on the boat. I like it. Actually, that goes... Mm. You know what? That goes with the trim on the boat better. Yeah, we're, we're gonna go with that. Alright. Time to set sail. Oh, you can really tell which one is me, huh? Alright. Now, the first thing to do is actually to go to the Peito. Sailing, sailing over the bountiful main. I'm going to go to the Peito so that I can get the Song of Resonance there. And then I will continue following the mainline quest after I do whatever there is to be done on the Peito. We'll see if there's time to actually go to Arthatine tonight. We shall see. Let's scooch over there, get that so I can boost. A two minute. A heartfelt message of support from Eshu stops hazardous waters gauge trigger in the sandstorm seas. Oh no! Well, I've wasted that. Okay. That is a pity. 
Ah, well. It's going to be a bit of a happiness once I get to that point, but it's okay. On to the Peto. Everyone who leaves Peto wants to come back. I just got an achievement called Stars Across the Ocean for some reason. But in any case, this is Peto, which is counted as an island, but is actually a ship. Welcome. And you know what? Gonna go down and take this quest from Dan Dan. Guys, are you having fun on the Peto? Let's make an unforgettable memory together today. Don't forget that every one of you has a special place in my heart. Entertainers, man. Okay, so I should cheer for Dan Dan. Woot! Alright, and then applaud the performance. I'm practically applauding right in his face. Do you think he can tell? Talk to producer Hermes. You're so energetic. How would you like to make a debut as an entertainment like Danny Danny? If you're interested, you'll have to audition. Sure. Good, then can you show me how you dance? You don't have to be n nervous. Um, you know, every time I've danced for an NPC, they have called it unique, but not good. All right, let's dance. Let's dance like a loser. Dancing, dancing like a loser. Ooh, you're just the kind of person I've been looking for. You're ready to make your debut right away. You just have to pay me a small fee. Want to sign a contract with me? Today must be my lucky day. Excellent, and your name is... Bittervine, I see. Good, very good. Nice to meet you. Now this is the ace up my sleeve that I prepared for our next show. It's a dance technique called the sway. Practice and memorize it as soon as you can. After all, Bittervine, you're the next one to perform on stage. Yes, I did the whole thing just so that I could have sway, which is a better dance, darn it. Alright, let's let and for the card packs. Let's not forget the card packs. All right, open both of those. Dadan and Haria. And what is in... What do I get out of this one? Golding! All right. Already had that one. Didn't have that one. Didn't have that one. All right. Let's look and see how... Did I complete anything? I did! Don't go too far. Crit plus one. Uh, added to Prelude. Added to Dark Rain Plains. Now halfway through Death Approaches. And got the first card of a Vesta, whatever that is. All right. Now, let's see... I believe the NPC I want to talk to is one of these ones up here. Um, it's either this guy or the treasure hunter that's almo almost on the edge of the screen. So let's 
Okay, no, it's it's not him. Welcome, Captain Viterine. Are you gathered in main sea bounties? If you can, actually, I've gathered absolutely none. I'll be back later about that. All right, here we go. Song of Resonance costs sixteen thousand five hundred pirate coins. But it's the only way to get this song. So, buying the Song of Resonance, learning the Song of Resonance, this song opens hidden spaces. Ooh. And then leaving the Peito entirely. Unless. Actually, now that I come to think of it, there's something I want to check. Let's go to the bazaar. Hup, 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 hup. All right, go in here. Wow, that was... Don't bother me now, child. Okay, now that I'm in here, I need to take the stairs. I have so many fewer pirate coins than I used to. Sadness. And... Nobody here has a quest for me, apparently. Okay, good enough. That's just something I wanted to check. It probably doesn't activate yet because I'm not level 50 yet, but I wanted to check anyway. All right, time to leave. The main problem that I have with islands is the fact that they... None of the islands let you use your mount. So no matter how big Welcome. the island is, you've got to run the whole thing because you can't use your mount. It's, it's kind of annoying. Like, the Peito is huge. I would really love to use a mount on the Peito. But no. Alright, hazardous waters. We are heading here. And it's a pity I don't have the luck thing anymore. But this is a sandstorm ship, so it should hopefully be okay. I'm just going to keep using the speed boost whenever it's uh, the meter fills up. This is really the main time waster of the game, I'd say, is the, the ocean traveling from place to place. It's kind of dull. When I'm playing on my own, I tend to read during this part. I, I just uh, put my feet up and, and get out a book and Wait to get where I'm going. I mean, I will manually go and skirt around hazardous seas, generally speaking, unless the quest requires me to go through them for some reason. Like this one is actually going to. It, it requires me to sail right into hazardous waters.
which you can just see them on the top edge of the mini-map there. That line, that line indicates hazardous waters, in this case sandstorm seas. So I'm just going to hurry to my doom. There we go. The sailors are having some issues. That's not the right boat. That's not the ship this I'm is sailing. The sandstorm seas. There are numerous hazardous waters like this on the high seas. So we need to be careful. All right, let's let's get out of this place. Now see, this meter here is the hazard meter, which it has a whole bunch of descriptive text here, which I'm not going to read. But basically, whenever this gauge fills up, the ship takes a lot of extra damage. So generally speaking, my preference would be to go sideways like this. Pull myself out of the sandstorm seas. And then let the auto tracker take control again outside of the sandstorm. Just to take a bit less damage. Although now I, I have issues cheer again, so I didn't need to do that, but I was just demonstrating, darn it. Alright, we made it, and we only lost about 700 durability with our side trip and all that stuff. So, let's dock. Ah, uh, Arthatine. We're going steampunk. Okay. Talk to immigration official Kruger. Welcome to Arthatine. Customs clearance. Welcome to Arthatine. So, what's the purpose of your visit? What? You're looking for the Ark? The legendary Ark? Ha ha ha! Another dreamer. Well, here in Arthatine, you can get your hands on any information you want. I'm sure you can find some tall tale about the Ark, too. Come to think of it, a reporter from Stern wrote an article on the Ark some time ago. Is that so? His name is Matthias. Why don't you go talk to him about it? Well, maybe I will. Oh, I, my oh, hair is already there. full of, of sand, I can tell. Huh? You want, you to... want information about Whoop. the Ark? <laughs> you get right down to business, don't you? Well, I can give it to you, but only for a price. Nothing's for free in this world, you get me? But hey, since you're not exactly from around here, I'll be generous. Help me write an article, and I'll tell you what I know. What do you say? Sure. Great, it's really simple. First, I want you to ask the people around here what they think about the cancellation of the Verdant here. What's the Verdant here? Jeez, don't you know? Did you just arrive or something? It's a huge tower-like device developed to turn into this desert, turn this desert into a verdant paradise. As the apex of Arthatine's technology, that tower was supposed to stretch up into the sky, 
Can't believe you've never heard of it before. It was a major project of, at an unprecedented scale, so news of it was everywhere. Was it everywhere on this continent, or was it everywhere in the world, sir? Well, if you don't know, now you do. But you'd better keep up with the news from now on. Okay, go ask around. We don't have all day. Sir, you might be an ass. Interested in a simple job? I've been receiving complaints about dirty, unreadable signboards, but I'm too busy to take care of them myself. Clean the sideboards around signboards around the port and come back to me. I'll reward you handsomely. Why did my reading ability, uh, my my speaking ability, just go down the drain all of a sudden? All right. I'll go this way. Thoughts on the Verdantier? The Verdantier can turn this desert into a lush paradise. Stopping its construction was the worst decision Bastion ever made. Who the heck is Bastion? All right. That performance enhancing drug. The fort needs a solid defense. Clean the sign because I happen to be here. Get back on the unicorn. Ask some more weird questions. Who knew Treasurer Sasha would oppose technologist Krauss? But I understand why she did it. I never did like the idea of the Verdant here. Okay. Clean this sign. Get back on the unicorn. Looking for a job. Patrol is all clear. Patrol is all clear. Talk to this person about the verdant here. Why do you ask? Are you with that jerk of a reporter from Hoyt News? No. I have nothing to say to you. Love you too. All right, clean this sign. Clean this sign. Try to guess which side this NPC is on. Uh, if I go down here, it's going to be up there, isn't it? Nope, nope, they're down here. There's no work to do now that the Verdant here construction got cancelled. I can understand how that would be your primary concern, yes. You know, you think you get a nice juicy contract for years worth of labor and then suddenly it gets cancelled and what are you supposed to do? You came back, thank you. I blame this problem on sea winds and the desert sandstorms. I'd better talk to my management and hire some more people. I wish you weren't a foreigner, I would have loved to work with you. Everybody thinks my bard is hot. So? Everyone has something to say, huh? I thought so. Okay. Everyone's suspicious. At the beginning of the construction, Administrator Bastion was fully supportive of Technologist Krauss. And then suddenly, just before the tower was set to be completed, Bastion put a halt to its construction. What's even more suspicious is that Treasurer Sasha took sides with the Administrator. Considering her relationship with the Technologist, the odds were that she would support Kraus. Can this be a checks and balances type of thing? Ever since the Guard was formed, the Technologist has become more powerful. A titanic power struggle among the three leaders? Hehehe! <laughs> I can write one heck of an article with red meat like that. Good job! Now, let's move on, shall we? Thought your job was done? Are you joking? Great! You didn't think the information you want is that cheap, did you? Now then, take this draft of my article to photographer Matt Marks. He'll let you know what to do next. Jessarian! Good evening! Hello! Ah, 
I'm being worked like a draft horse here. My name is Basilok. You look like a strong warrior. What, which agency represents you? If you don't have one, then maybe you should consider mine. Eckhorn Mercenary Office. My agency represents many famous mercenaries. Even regulators and local militias use our services. I am doing pretty good. It is really steamy and hot in my city right now, but I'm surviving, keeping myself hydrated. Let us represent you and you'll be swimming in jobs. Our clients pay better than most too. So would you like to sign a contract with us? Yes, since it's a benefit to me, I'll sign it. Good, you've made an excellent choice. You won't regret it. Here, take this. It's your sunk contract. Sign here and we'll be a team. All right. Sign that mercenary contract. Eckhorn Office Mercenary Contract Terms and Conditions Mercenary Contract Entered into an effective as of between office and mercenary 1. Contract period This contract remains effective for an unlimited time unless mercenary retires or expresses their wish to withdraw from the contract 2. Brokerage Commission Office is entitled to a 10% brokerage commission for every job it introduces to mercenary 3. Legal Liability Office only accepts jobs that comply with the law. Mercenary is prohibited from taking on illegal jobs in the name of office. Personal favors excluded. Office and mercenary hereto have agreed to these terms and conditions and executed this contract as acknowledged by their signatures below. Signed, Bittervine. This is actually a really fair contract. Did you sign it? Let me see. Great! Thank you for choosing Eckhorn Mercenary Office. A while ago, the Port Guard arrested someone who had an illegal performance-enhancing drug. It turned out that this banned product was released on the black market in massive quantities. My office found out that there's a group of suppliers for these drugs. According to my intel, they're making a trade today at the Market District on the east side of Lupinport. We already know who these smugglers are, so head over there now. Follow them and identify their base and distribution routes. Okay, that sounds interesting. I'll do it. And here's me with my white unicorn and my white dress and my white self in the desert. I'm a die. All right. I will hide and eavesdrop. Oh, I'm translucent. Listen to the smuggler's conversation. Boy, they're complaining about sandstorms. They're they're just standing around complaining about the weather. All right. Uh, wait for five seconds atop the building. Okay, so climb the building and observe the situation for five seconds. Alright, disguise myself as a smuggler. Say the password while disguised as a smuggler. Oh dear, what was the password? I wasn't paying attention. Ahem, how's the weather today? There will be sandstorms. You came. It must be tough working in such dry weather. Where's the merchandise? I was just basing that on what I overheard, honestly. 
What, you don't have it yet? Er, this is why I told you to move your factory. I know it's the only place the port guard doesn't bother to look, but I told you I can do this right under their noses. For now, go get the merchandise. My customers are getting impatient. And make sure to tell your boss to consider moving his facilities. Okay. Walk away. Walk away, walk away, walk away, walk away. Keep walking. Take off the disguise. You're back. Did you learn anything useful? So, there's an emerald ampoule factory where the port guard doesn't patrol. I think I know where that might be. There's an abandoned village east of Lupin Port. It was built to mine portent stones and it closed down after the mine dried up. The smugglers must be based there. Good work locating their base so quickly. I'd better let the port guard know where it is, too. If you have time later, go see port guard Captain Kling. Smugglers like them are always bad news for the guard. Now that we know where they are, it's time to round them up. Let's get a hold of that merchandise first. Infiltrate their base and steal their boxes of emerald ampoules. I'll send a guy named Hearts out to help you. He'll get you disguised as a smuggler. Sounds good. Okay. I need to go over here. Use this elevator to leave the port. I'm trying to. Elevator go up. Okay, uh Yeah what I'm gonna I'm gonna go do this first. Hey, hey, hey. Well that was nearly horrible. Just uh skip past all this nonsense. World of nope going on here. Stop that, all of you. I believe I've made my point. Are you bitter, Vine? Let's get on with our mission then, shall we? Before you arrived, I was able to contact one of the smugglers. He'll tell us where they keep the emerald ampoules in exchange for our help getting him out of that group. Wear these clothes and sneak into their base. The surly smuggler will be waiting for you. Okay. Take a uniform from the sack. Transform. Uh... Yeah, go, go this way. Oh, this is this is gonna be a long this is gonna be a long one. Oh boy. Um why does it have to be so far away? Uh It's so far. Why is it so far? Okay, I'll get there eventually. Someday. What took you so long? It's time for the shift change. We have to worry. Hey, I can only walk so fast in this. Take this elevator down and tell the un unenthusiastic smuggler that I sent you. He'll tell you where the emerald ampoule boxes are. All right, take the elevator. Taking the elevator. Uh, this is so slow. Oh, why is this so slow? 
You're from the outside, aren't you? I can tell. I'm known for my good judgment skills around here. What, the irritable guy told you to talk to me? So, you're from the mercenary office. He's really determined to get out of this life. I don't blame him. I want to quit, too. Follow this passageway down, and you'll see an iron door. The emerald ampoules are stored on the other side of it. Okay, I'll just continue walking very slowly. At least I have some cleavage to look at, but, you know, this is still... Could I at least move at my, at my proper speed? There was no door. Take all the ampoules inside the chest. All right. Report to mercenary officer... Oh, man. Okay, okay. Well, I don't want to walk back. So... Cannot perform this action during a transformation. Okay. Drop the transformation. Then transport back. See ya, suckers! And now I can use my unicorn. Oh, thank goodness. Speed, grace, sparkles. Good work out there. I'll turn these emerald ampoules over to the port guard right away. I'll also put in a good word with the guard for those two kidnappers who helped you. By the way, did you learn where they got the recipe for this drug? No, no, I actually, I didn't. I got an achievement for my charisma level though, which means what? Oh, my roster leveled up at some point, okay. I'll take that. And we have reached Charisma 55. Nice. Okay, back Use to the main, the main story quest. Gonna go take some photos. Gonna get chased by some scorpions to take some photos. This is his uh, news draft. It's finally here. Yep. Matthias, that jerk. Though he's not completely amoral. At least he sent me some help. Yeah, drafted. Okay, I'd like for you to go up the hill and take some photos. I've already set up a camera there. All you have to do is click the button. Hurry! Why didn't you when you were setting up the camera? These people. No logic in them. Oh yeah, I already went all the way up this hill and set up a camera. But take pictures with it? What do you take me for? A person with fingers? Alright, we're gonna take some photos. Wait, that's not what I was supposed to be taking pictures of. That is a lot of, of, that's a lot. Okay, and, oh, wait, I can slide down this hill! Let's see. What? This is the mech corpse. You don't say. That's strange. Where is it going? I thought that ever since the cancellation of the Verdant Shears construction, the mech corpse was disbanded. Guard Burkle is the one in charge here. Go ask him if the order to disband the Corps was ever carried out. Was the disbandment order for the mech corps carried out? Sorry, I don't have time to answer. Wait. 
You look pretty capable, adventurer. Do you take on mercenary jobs by any chance? Well, uh, since you happen to mention, we've been warned by a mysterious extremist group that it would like to that it would attack our trains. The time they promised it would happen is getting closer, but we're not even close to identifying who made the threat. We need your help to find them. The northern outpost is the most desperate for help. Please war report to Captain Schweiger there. He'll tell you what to do. Okay. What happened? Were you able to confirm? Nope. You know, it seems like people in official positions don't really like to talk about this sort of stuff with complete and utter strangers. What do you mean that's not important? Impending train attack? That sounds serious, right? What are you doing? You're helping them find the terrorists? Okay, go do that. I'll take care of the issue with the mech corpse. To fix TMAS, I need crystallized quartz and scrap iron. Could you help me? This guy is my friend, but he's such an old model that his replacement parts are not readily available. Everyone tells me to give up on him, but I could never ever do that to him. Please, would you be so kind as to help me? I'll help. Thank you for being so kind. You can find crystallized quartz in the supply crates in the nearby base. As for scrap iron, you'll have to fight the mecha sappers. Mecha sappers. Blah, blah, blah. TMAS is such an old model that now the metal used in him can only be found in those things. Um, getting some parts from those scrappers isn't illegal, is it? When you get all the necessary materials, please give them to my colleague, researcher Parnell. Okay. How would you like to work with me on some potentially great research? Sure, absolutely. I knew it. Of course you'd help me. I'm telling you, this could be a monumental research project. You'd regret if you missed out on this opportunity. Thank you for your cooperation. Arthatine is a city-state built on a desert. Nowhere except for Nibblehorn is capable of producing water on its own. This means that the country spends a lot of money on importing both drinking and industrial water. I've come up with a genius idea to alleviate this problem. Walu cacti, Walu cacti live all across Arthatine. They release sap when threatened. Their sap is slightly toxic, but I've also got a solution for that. You want water from the living cacti? Yes. Where do you think all the water in the desert is? It's clearly in the cacti. Their slap is slightly toxic, but I've got a solution for it. I just don't know how much sap each cactus produces. Could you help me figure this out? You'll have to travel pretty far for this research. Use the communication device to report to me. You can get permission to use it from Guard Jelrin at the Northern Guard Post. Kill some cacti, measure some liquid. Sounds like a fun time. Heading into the desert. Destroying the raging machines. Mmm, feels good. You know what, forget, forget that one singular. Let's grab this cluster. Still need more samples from cacti, though. Ah, two birds, one stone. Whoop! Kaboom! Like 
to you know what I'm I'm leaving. I'm jealous. Oh, I forgot to get the quartz pieces. Back on the unicorn. Up over here. Grab some stuff out of this box. And back I go. Hello. Crystallized quartz and scrap iron? Did SL ask you to bring these to me? Ugh, I've told him TMAS is a lost cause. It's so old that I doubt it'll turn on, even with new parts. I suppose I'll make new parts for him one last time. All right, insert, tweak. It talks! Did you see that? It was just for a moment, but TMAS talked. Maybe one day he'll speak like he did when I was young. I swear, I'll fix him like new. Thank you for giving me hope. Cool. Okay, around over here. New parts? I'm jealous. There may be bombs, but the train is still running. Are they out of their minds? Maybe. Who are you? What? Burkle hide you? An adventurer from a different continent. Then it's safe to assume you're not part of that armed group. Truth be told, we need strong warriors like you. Welcome aboard. You've heard the story, right? Some group of scumbags declared that they would blow up one of our trains. Well, I'm not going to let that happen. I've sent my men to keep an eye on all the train tracks. Well, almost all. The only one left is on this cliff. I'd like you to go up there and keep watch on it. Here, take this bomb disposal kit. With it, you can disarm almost any bomb. Don't worry, I'll tell you how to use it. Just keep your radio on. Now, head to the train track on the cliff. Well, first I'm going to talk to Jelrin here. Ah, uh, you must be the one I've heard about. Let me take that sap you brought. Now you may use the communication device. Please report to Evangel immediately. All right. It's you. I've been waiting for you. How did it go? How many cacti did you need to hunt to get that much? Hmm, I see. All right, thank you for helping me collect such useful data. Their sap is definitely marketable. Soon, everyone will be drinking Walu sap instead of water. Thank you so much. I gave Jelrin your payment, so you should talk to him. Hmm. Did you report to her? Good job. I hope she succeeds in this research and helps relieve our water shortages. Stuff and things! Take that, take that, just sort of stuff that up there for now. All right, up, 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 up. Oh, wait, I did, I, I wasn't supposed to be up here yet. I was supposed to... All right, turn on the radio, then investigate. Now, I started a little bit late, so I'm going to... Help us Check the, the tracks on the cliff as well as on the northeast side. Hey, the ones on the cliff. So I'm going to, to run a bit over it. Let me through. As you can see, the situation is dire. The people I'd are like to ask for your aid. That is I what I'm here for. Others. Let me through. Alright, 
eliminate smugglers. Did practically nothing. There we go. It's just these ones left, I think. Yep, there we go. Open the gate. A lot of HP on this one. You know what you need, sir? You you need an ego harp. And maybe some laser. Oh, it's taken off a lot of my HP. died before I did. I'm a coming out ahead. Yeah. Right? Right? All right. Take off that barrier. Stand over here. Hey. Can you hear me now? Yeah. What? You discovered the bombs. Oh, I knew it. Quick, get the bomb disposal kit. Okay. Quickly, before it explodes. Move on to the tracks. There is a train coming. Hurry. You're running out of time. The train is coming. Remember, it's the red wire. Cut the red wire, okay. Uh... Thank the gods. We made it. That was a real close one. <laughs> Did the bomb just rearm? Yep. And look, I'm standing on the track. Uh, you know what? Boot that bomb! Get off the track! Are you okay? Do you copy? No. Damn self-rearming bombs. This anyway, is a common thing? You saved many innocent lives today. He didn't seem surprised by the rearming bombs. This is the transport ministry. Who is this? Identify. 
identify yourself. Well, what was that loud noise? Excuse me, you were hired by Captain Schweiger? So, the warning about a bombing attack wasn't a prank. Oh, my Septrum. Um, I think I just got thanked, but I also got bumped right on out of there before I could read it. So, um, report to Outpost Captain Schweiger. Okay. I will absolutely do that and not deal with all these scorpions. No, the elevator! Alright, hi, I'm here and I lived. Anyway. You saved many innocent lives today. Yay! Thank you, stranger. That was the stuff that heroes are made of. You risked your life to save the people of Arthatine. Come to think of it, I don't even know your name. Bittervine? Your name is Bittervine, huh? You'll be forever remembered as a true hero. On behalf of the Arid Gar Path Guard, I'd like to express our gratitude and appreciation. I am level 50 now. A lot of stuff all just happened at once. Can I level up another skill? Probably. I think I would like to level up my march, actually. And frankly, the the ego harp is not doing me a lot of good, unfortunately. Uh, what if I turned down the harp so that I can have two level 10 skills? Okay, I can have a threatening march with outgoing damage plus 200%. Or I can have a melody march where the serenade, me, me, the serenade meter gains 200%. Well, I'm going with damage. Bwahahaha. Ha ha. And what have we here? Many guide quests. Okay, skip the one about joining a guild. Marina Life. Visit Marina near Plekia. Okay. Co-opting the sea. Complete co-opting the sea quest. Collect Gaina's coins. Okay. Wandering merchant ship. Visit a merchant ship near the coast. Port Krona's tea and Lieber guild vessel or Arid Pass tea and Lieber guild vessel or Changun's tea and Lieber guild vessel. Uh, sure. And the path of the true adventurer. Adventurer's Tome and Ignea Tokens. Listen to Adventurer Bird's explanation. I need to talk to Bird to learn about the Adventurer's Tome and a new collectible, Ignea Tokens. I can find Bird at Naria's Tavern in the city. Okay. I will take all of those, and then I'm going to go over here, and I'm going to turn off the tracking for most of them. Uh, I will leave the talk to Bird at Naria's Tavern because I can do that here. There's a Naria's Tavern on this, on this continent. I'll get to it eventually. But I really don't want to be tracking all of those, uh, we'll call them overseas quests. And also I've gotten a, two new titles. Okay, we've got Love. For level up a bard to combat level 50, which just happened. You saw it here on stream. And Dandy, increase a character to combat level 50 for the first time in the roster. Nice. And what else do we have here? Memory chamber, no. Uh, I'm not going to deal with the integrated preset, honestly. I got a new hat, I think. Yes. 
Yay, new hat. Uh, oh, there is so much stuff here. Forget that. Um, universal storage? Ooh! Sure, I'll take those amethyst shards. And... Yeah, there's a... Uh, okay. That takes care of all that, and even though I'm level 50, I'm still not ready for most of the level 50 stuff. So, I'm just going to continue as I have been. And I need to go... Okay. Wait a minute. Have I... I've gotten all the triports in this map? Excellent. Alright. I'm gonna take the quick way back. Because as much as I love my unicorn... Just sitting here saying, I'm going, I'm going, I'm riding the unicorn, the unicorn's going, I'm bypassing all this stuff, I'm going, I'm... It's very boring. Troll is all clear. Hello, Captain Kling. I heard. On behalf of the port guard, thanks for your help. I've reported your heroic deed to Regulator Headquarters in Stern. Expect a considerable reward soon. By the way, are you friends with Matthias? I suggest you choose your companions carefully. Nothing good comes from hanging out with third-rate reporters like him. Anyway, he's waiting for you on the train passenger platform. I suppose if you really want to, you should go see him. Well, sure. Was there anything else? Oh, there was something else. Wait a minute. Oh, that's that's all going out to the open seas. Okay, that's that's not important. Hey, Matthias, hi. <laughs> Color me impressed. Sure. Who knew that sending you on an errand would end up saving a ton of lives? Heh, <laughs> not to mention the fact that I get to write an exclusive article. I haven't turned in a scoop like this for a long time. I've got a lot to thank you for, so I'll tell you what I know about the Ark, as promised. Did you know that an Ark was discovered in Lutera? Oh, you did. That's a fairly new piece of information, so now I'm doubly impressed. I was there! Anyway, the first king of Lutera was a Sidereal. You knew that too, right? If he had an Ark, I wonder what the other Sidereals might have had. In fact, I bet there's an Ark in Arthatine. There's no true Sidereal here now, true, but Sidereal Galator did visit here for a while. But that was a few centuries ago. I wouldn't know where to begin to look for him. Administrator Bastian might know something, though. He has access to all the information archived in Arthatine. Want to meet him? You'll need to head to Stern first. My editor-in-chief has some connections there, so I'll ask him for help. Take this article to prove you're with me, and I'll send word ahead. That way, they know to expect you. And here, take this train pass to Stern. It's the least I can do. A new hero saves Stern. The train bombing attempted by a mysterious armed group has been successfully thwarted. The hero who was instrumental in this miraculous feat is named Bittervine, an adventurer from a different continent. There were plenty of dangerous moments as the adventurer attempted to disarm the explosive set up along the train track, but our intrepid hero emerged victorious, saving thousands of lives in the process. Everyone at Hoyt News applauds this selfless act. We look forward to hearing about more great stories from this new hero of Arthatine, Bittervine, Hoyt reporter Matthias. Well, I am a hero. Show my train pass to the station attendant. I've confirmed your ticket. Thank you. And enjoy your ride to Stern. Sure. I'll get on the train that I just saved. I mean, I'm assuming, but... So the engineer is going to be driving backwards the entire way to Stern. That doesn't seem entirely comfortable. And here I am.
shiny bard in the big city. All right, first thing. Go get this triport. Excellent. Okay. Who in blazes wrote this article? Okay. So, I think that this is where I'm going to call it a night. Uh, just uh, looking on at this cluster of bots around the editor in chief. You know what? Let's let's I not look at the cluster of bots. But... I'll just. I'll end as we started with a close-up. I look different in this light than I did in Annika. So, uh, this is where I'm going to call it a night. Our bitter vine is going to take a week-long rest, and, and then tomorrow she'll hand in the article and possibly get yelled at for it being late. Who knows? But, for anyone who is wondering uh, how things got to this point, what I've been up to, how many times I've died, how many times this NPC is going to yell before I finish my usual speeches, you can find that out from my YouTube channel, all except for that last one. <laughs> there is a playlist there for Lost Ark, and uh, so you don't have to go digging through everything. How many pages do we have left? They say there's only one truth. There are a lot of NPCs talking in this room. Maybe I shouldn't have come in here, but now it's too late. Now I'm in here with the talking NPCs, so I'm sorry if they interrupt me a little. And I will be back again on Wednesday night, starting as close to 7 p.m. as we can get enough people together to form a room. I will be playing Among Us with a pack of my mostly out of their mind friends. We'll run around gaslighting each other, lying to each other, stabbing each other in the back, and having a grand old time. And unlike my other streams, the Among Us streams are not archived in full on my YouTube oh, channel. I only put up occasional clips, so if you want to see the full Among Us stream, you will have to tune in on Wednesday. Then I will be back again on Thursday night, starting at 7.30 p.m. Eastern Time. I will be playing Surviving the Aftermath for Try Not to Die Thursday. Surviving the Aftermath is a game where an apocalypse has occurred, truth, but... and then a world war that crushed what was left of civilization after the apocalypse. And now it is my job to keep my small-ish camp of survivors alive and healthy and maybe happy if I feel like actually doing that for them. And generally shepherd them back into rebuilding a portion of civilization that I can call my own. So that will be happening on Thursday. Then, on Sunday night, starting at 10 p.m. Eastern Time, I will be playing an RPG called Game Deck, where I play as a... Oh boy. I play as a private investigator who, in a cyberpunk future, who mainly investigates crimes committed in online games. At the moment in that game, I'm trapped in a labyrinth. I am trapped in a labyrinth that is very, very white. How many do we have left? And I'm really hoping that it will say there's only one truth, gain some color. Because it's, it's, uh, it's very stark. And as I was complaining earlier this evening, uh, it's uh, all that white light, it's a little hard on me. So I'm really hoping the labyrinth gains some color, and also that I can figure out how to navigate the thing. Uh, so far I've only been given very basic instructions, so cross fingers and hope for me on the finding my way through the labyrinth, hopefully without having to fight a minotaur. And then, on Monday night, starting at 7.30 p.m. Eastern Time, Lost Ark will be returning, where I will be dealing with all of these yelling people who are in the background of my, of my outro right now. 
I will be continuing to play the Bard. I will be trying to get her equipment level up to 250 and to get her through this continent so that she can go on to the next one, which is a very important one. one truth, but... um, basically, uh, the, the idea is to reach level 50, which I have, finish this continent, go on to the next one, and then unlock all the special stuff that level 50s can do, which is all unlocked on the next continent from where I am. So, I will be running through and uh, trying to get all the quests done here and get it done. Like, do all the quests, but do them quickly so that I can get on to uh, the next continent and hopefully having an equipment level where I can Ooh, do the stuff that level 50s can do, which is equipment level 250, which my character, she's not quite there yet, but with with some luck, I will be there once I finish doing the story quests and stuff through this continent. So, that's, that's the idea. Work? That is the upcoming week in my schedule. Tonight has been a lot of fun. They I am absolutely thrilled trip, that I didn't die. Uh... There, there were a couple of points where I realized that I hadn't been paying attention to my HP and I got a little worked up mentally. Um, so that, that was, uh, that was definitely a thing, but I didn't die tonight. I did not die tonight at all. I'm so thrilled. So it's been a lot of fun. I hope that all of you had at least as much fun as I did. And I hope to see you again at my next stream on Wednesday. Who in wrote this article? <laughs> and that you have a great night. Good night!